Hello everyone, today I'm going to do a YouTube video about testing a home internet or testing a cellular plant on a cellular router. This is useful if you are in the RV, but for me, I just trying to be stingy, okay? Just keep that in mind. What, um, anyway, also it's knowledge learning. So what I'm showing you is a speed test to a testing for video on the Netflix server right there, as you can see. Fast.com is actually very, uh, it's one of the site is very important when you use for speed test for testing uh, your, what you might call it, like uh, your carrier that limits you for the video streaming quality so t-mobile which is what we have limits two points on gigahertz on a something like that but i do not know how they you know figured out which one they've been doing that all carrier been doing that but anyway all right i didn't want to get copyright strike for that so anyway long story short here's your uh, speed test as you can see we currently has a vpn active on this device so that's how I was able to uh, get this high speed if I did not have VPN on it it would be only 2.4 or 2.5 megabyte which is 720p quality streaming now keep in mind T-Mobile like to do that just like every other carrier uh, so to get around that this is not a news you use a VPN um, over here is a router from they call it x3000 uh, from GLI net it is a so far a good router I've been testing it for the last couple of hours by you know taking different places and place in different places and just to test the quality of the network basically how much I can get I did try to get the Netgear M6 Pro refurbished router on Amazon that did not turn out at all it refused to go into the band 71 it just keeps stuck in on the LTE and the speed is just not even close to what I'm getting here so it just kind of has sign of relief and also that device is it's joke because the touch screen refused to work and I'm sure it's like because it's refurbished unit but if I get a brand new it probably would be better but at the same time if I get the pearl one it's gonna be eight hundred dollar so uh, I'm not that much rich so anyway uh, long story short I'm just using the fast stock net but uh, speed tests also work as well I really think speed tests um, you can use speed tests for generally a decent amount of thing and we are going to do that really quick so this now it's asking for uh, information so the pin on this definitely higher and but the pin all you know if you don't use for like other than doing your homework upload YouTube video and all that stuff this is great I can push upload on this and this front because uh, we have breeze line we have spectrum we do not have fiber so we do not get symmetrical speed up and down so for that this is normal for me to have a Ford 47 you know up and 50 up for an upload speed and just less than one mile away uh, we have a fiber for AT&T but um, we I personally uh, couldn't get it which is fine you know fiber are very selected so but the point is it's possible now you might wonder how did this works well this one requires you to get a cellular plant right cellular plant is not cheap you can you know the one that worked for this one is T-Mobile so AT&T and T-Mobile are the main one that you want to look at whenever you are doing a, you know, 
fucking around. Now, your your speed might vary due to your plan, due to your whatever. So, Magenta Starter is one of the deprioritized network. So, basically, what I'm saying is, T-Mobile has three plans. So that, that it very it's very important what you choose to make this work. If you're the T-Mobile Magenta, we got hundred megabyte of priority data on the T-Mobile network. Keep in mind, I'm probably gonna hit hundred megabytes just to show you guys. But keep running speed test after speed test after speed test. During a network that's not congested, and that's how you eat up the data very, very quickly. But for you guys, you just need to know that if it worked for you guys, that's all that matters. I cannot show you how I use like Facebook because it has you know personal information or whatever. I mean, technically, Facebook is not personal, but still, I don't need to be. Strunching around for that, but long story short, um, if you choose to have a magenta plan, your speed gonna be varied based on your location, your network nearby. If you're in the city, if you're outside the city, where you at makes big, big, big difference. And also, where you mounting that um, router at. So do keep that in mind. And it also, the device came with a SIM card that I had not switched to it. It only allows a one gig of data, and I'm not sure which network it uses. So, but long story short, I have not tried that one yet. So anyway, if you guys looking for a router, uh, Sparks, it's pretty good. Now you can get the other one, the little bit higher one. But the one that has batteries and all that stuff, that's like five hundred dollar. Uh, I'm not sure if that's worth it, just because for many of you guys, you're not gonna go any higher than that technology. You guys can look into it, see what you think. But to me, I'm thinking, well, I always can return it, but at the same time, I have to be careful because Amazon will ban you or if you return so much stuff. But long story short, it's one of those kind of risk take you had to do to kind of learn. Because if I didn't buy this, I wouldn't be able to know how this perform, how this work. But so far, I really liking, and I did have a, a GLI net a travel router as well, and I really liked them as well. It was really great router that. Allows you to do more with it, just in the router. It's a travel router. If you want, I want to make more video about that as well. So anyway, if you like this video, please give a like. If not, just comment down the below that you hate it. I'm sure I've seen it plenty, but be nice.、Uh, you know, I am human as well. But end of the day, if you stay this long, you know. You're true, and I appreciate it for watching all the way to the end. Not many people do, just because I have a very thick accent.、Um, so anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys on the next one. Peace out.